Hey there, welcome to Healthy TV, episode number 51. And on today's show, we're talking about how to reconnect with nature. So as you can see, I've brought you on uh, location with me again this week. I'm at the uh, end of what's called Sarsaparilla Trail, just outside of Canada off Moody Drive. And I chose this particular location this week because, um, well, perhaps I'll back up a step. Last week I announced the new challenge for the month of July, which is to satisfy your requirements for vitamin N. Uh, vitamin N meaning nature and this re essential requirement really for the healthier brain to get immersed in nature uh, for a chunk of time regularly. So we're setting the bar pretty low at two hours per week. And I wanted to share with you the how, like how can you actually fit this into your uh, week easily. And so for those of you um, in and around the practice, you know, that uh, live in the West End of Ottawa, um, I wanted to share with you some of the easiest accessible trails um, that you can um, get your family to. It doesn't take a lot of effort, doesn't take a lot of planning, uh, and yet you can quickly be immersed in nature just like this um, particular location I'm at. So like I mentioned, Sarsaparilla Trail um, is a very short trail. It's only about you know, 500 meters, I think, uh, round trip, so it's very short. So it'd be perfect for young families, especially if you've got toddlers that you, that, you know, that are independent that, you want, uh, that they want to uh, do the whole walk. Um, and it culminates at this end point here, which is, uh, you can see behind me, there's a pond, um, lots of wildlife around. You can hear the birds chirping. Um, I've seen some turtles. I've seen, um, I've already seen a beaver. Uh, you know, I'm sure there's lots of minnows and frogs elsewhere. And so um, this is a, a great place um, to bring a family where your kids can actually start to get um, a, a positive attachment to nature. And that's, I think, as a parent, that would be one of the most important um, things that you can pass on to your kids is this positive attachment to nature because our natural environment, we can't ignore the fact that we evolved for the you know 99.8% of our, uh, our history uh, has evolved, we evolved in the context of a natural environment like this. And so there's a lot that goes on inside our bodies that's connected or that's stimulated or that's promoted um, by in getting immersed in nature. Okay, and all that is happening in the brain. So I'm big on brain health, as those of you know me, and so I want to do everything I can to maximize or optimize my brain health. And certainly getting into nature is one of those things. So for the next four weeks, I'm going to be sharing with you some of my, uh, the easiest accessible trails in and around Kanata, Stittsville, um, and also be sharing some of my favorite ones in Gatineau Park, um, for those of you who are a little bit more adventurous um, and want to maybe make a bigger, a big, bigger day for it but uh, really the key thing is keep it simple um, chunk it down so that you have easily accessible have uh, it's easy for you to get your family involved and uh, make it uh, make it a great day okay so I will be uh, checking in over the next four weeks um, but until then have a great weekend